Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Preeti Salve from Kaley College of Pharmacy, Bergavi, and today we'll be performing the synthesis of 2,3-diphenylquinoxalin. So the reactants that we are going to use here are ophenylene diamine and benzyl, and we are going to obtain our product, which is 2,3-diphenylquinoxalin. So here we are going to perform a condensation type of reaction wherein you can see that there will be removal of these two water molecules and a cyclization reaction will take place after which the quinoxalin ring is going to be formed. So we are going to take two different solutions. One will be orthophenyl and diamine in alcohol and the second one will be benzene in alcohol. What we are going to do is mix both of these solutions and heat it on a water bath for about 30 minutes and due to the condensation and simultaneous cyclization that is happening, we are going to get a final compound which is 2,3-diphenyl quinoxalin. So let us move on to the practical procedure of this synthesis. So moving on to the practical experiment, we are going to have two different solutions. Our first solution is a warm solution of 2.1 gram of benzyl and 8 ml of alcohol. To this we are adding a second solution which is 1.1 gram of orthophenyl and diamine and 8 ml of alcohol. So we are just going to mix both of these so two solutions and we are going to keep it on a water bath for a period of 30 minutes. During the entire procedure, care has to be taken that the solution should not get boiled because if it boils too much, the ethanol is going to get evaporated. So we can continue with the procedure by turning off the burner for a few minutes and then putting it on. And in this way, we can complete the synthesis procedure for a total of 30 minutes. Once the reaction has been completed, we will transfer the contents to a beaker and we are going to allow the entire solution to cool down and our 2,3-diphenylquinoxalin is going to get crystallized out as the ethanol evaporates. 